stars. Delicious. Just went to this cafe while strolling around this cute little street. Just got breakfast and I was walking around. Let's go look at that. That looks so good. It's insane. <gasps> look at that fruit tart. That is insane. Yum. We're in Paris. It's day one. Um, we went to breakfast this morning, which is about to order. And then we had brunch at the this Paris cafe near our spot. And now we're just shopping. We're about to go for dinner, but we came for an apple spritz at this place. What's it called? Le. I'm gonna butcher everything that I say. Le Deville. Le Deville. But yeah, it's really cute. It's on what road is it? Yeah, that road. And we're just like shopping around. And we're just gonna have an apple roll and then go to dinner, which I'm very excited for. That looks so good. Merci. <gasps> Yummy. Just what we need a little snack <laughs> yeah. with our apple rolls. And the marshmallows. We yeah. <laughs> have. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not sure about the vibe. Cheers to you, night one in Paris. That's Aperol in Paris. Approved. We just had our Aperol spritzies. And now we're going to this, to Lord, Lord Doré. And it's famous for their macarons. So uh, I think we'll probably just get like a takeaway box if that's possible. Oh, they do like lots of stuff. But it's really cute, it's on the same street. That's where we just ate. <laughs> wow, this is so pretty. Yum. We're going to Pink Mama for dinner now. And this is the outside, which is really cute. We do have a booking. This is so cute. So we got margarita, pizza, arancini bowls, and then black truffle pasta. Yo, this looks so good. Is it good? Again, arancini bowl. What flavor is it? Is it good? And we're so hungry as well, so. I'm gonna film them. I could, I could do like 15 of these. <laughs> Salty. <laughs> yeah, wow. It's good, it means we're all drinking a lot more water. Mm. 10 out of 10. My ready pizza taste. Zoom. Oh, it's really sunny. <laughs> It's so dummy. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Channel jam. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some sort of cream in it. Yeah. Oh my god. Wow. It's so good. I can eat that every single day. Yeah, it's really long. <laughs> The fact that it's in a saucepan, I know. like I could taste it straight away. So good. Oh, wow. That is amazing. Yeah. We need like 12 breath of yeah. Get it all in the sauce. Yeah. Oh wow, it's gonna be, be gonna be even better with the sauce. Yeah. This ice cream is really good. It's made with their own eggs. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> 10 out of 10. We'll be getting this probably every night after dinner. Just every night, just pop for it. We'll do a full review of Pink Mama at the place we went for dinner, and then we'll also do a macaroon try of the ones we got at Lodre. Those ones. Um, so yeah. So wee wee Perry. Cute. Okay, we're doing a 
Can you say it? Oh. Lodre. 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 Um, haul. Unboxing and haul. So this is the bag they came in. They have macarons. Look how pretty this is. This could be like a jewelry box. Yeah, I reckon keep it. Like if I bought jewelry in this, I'd be happy. Okay, so we got six <clears throat> macarons. Oh, that looks so yummy. I might need to take a photo of these. <gasps> so, this came with it as well. Very fancy. So we got... Um, did we get a lemon, a lemon one? That was the mimosa. Oh, okay. We got mimosa, which is the yellow. Green, pistachio, pink, rose, white is vanilla, brown chocolate, and then the salt to caramel. Yeah. Oh, what one's in the tray there? I don't know. Any mean one away. Go for a basic one first, I reckon. Vanilla. Boring. Boring. <laughs> <laughs> um, Try an extra. I feel like you should, you choose whatever one you want. Rose? Yeah. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> God, okay, they are. Stop the crash. Yeah. Oh, they're so pretty. Wow. Is it like rude to break it? Yeah. Wow, wow they look like. That's not gonna focus. They look moist. That looks moist. Go for it. They're so okay. fresh. Can you see that? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> test. Wow. Rosy. <gasps> oh my god, wait, breathe. Breathe in. Can you feel that in your throat? Mm. That's so nice. Oh my gosh. It's like eating. It's like eating perfume. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's a winner. Wow, you can like feel that down your throat. Mm. I don't need any others, so that's all good. Yeah, no, that's good. <laughs> but I'm sure they'll be all good. I already had ice cream. Oh, that one was the one with the sparkles. Mimosa. Try a sparkling one. Should I try one more? Mm. You already had dessert, but <laughs> I'm on holiday. Okay, I'll try the mimosa because that one looks fun. Oh my gosh, they're so like airy. You could yeah. literally eat a whole box. I'll give you the big piece. Do you want it oh, now? No. Check it. Check Are you sure? One. Oh wait, you're having a piece now? Okay, okay, okay. Do you want the big one? Okay. <laughs> yeah, this one's got sugar on it. Mmm. Doesn't really taste much. After the rose one. The rose one I can like feel in my that chest. That was so like... It literally just I didn't like, even put it in my mouth and I could taste it. It literally tastes like perfume. It's, more, it's quite coconutty. It is a bit. I, honestly, I thought it would be more fruity. I needed to cleanse my palate mm. afterwards. No, it's it really coconut. good. It's not that fruity though. Yeah, no, it's not. Mimosa. I thought it was more like very orangey. Anyways, highly recommend. We'll save these for another time. But Worth getting the queue wrong four times. Yeah. It was a really pretty place though. So mm. yeah, they're famous for macarons and they've got other like tarts and stuff. Highly recommend. Day two. And we're going to Cafe de Flore, which is that. It's one of the most like popular trendy ones. And we're gonna get breakfast. Where am I? Testing the croissant and chocolate. I might just like eat and then sit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's so dang. Oh, my God, yum. Good. Yep, so good. It looks like milk chocolate. Good. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. That's so good. So rich. Wow. Yeah, it is. It's really no milk in it. <laughs> yeah, just a chocolate. So, child, we read it 10 out of 10. Would you say it's worth the hype? Mm. Yeah. I'll be interested in comparing it to. Oh, yeah, we next haven't been door. to too many other ones. Oh, yeah. Compare it to next door. Which is the Maggots one. But we've only really been to one other one. And we're going to go to Corette as well. So, we can, we can give a full review once we've gone to all of them. We're at Bambini. We're gonna try get a table. This is so pretty. It was fully booked out, so I'm gonna see if we can get a spot. Bonjour, bonjour. Oh, yay. Oh, 
Angel. Where do you want to sit? You choose. Yeah, that looks so good. So yum. Yeah, this is the menu. This is what we're working with. So we're thinking pasta, pizza. And then maybe a couple starters. But it's so pretty in here. I love it. So we got truffle arancini. And then we got calamari, which looks so yummy. I'm gonna try the half. I'm trying the arancini. It's truffle arancini. It tastes like the pasta from last night Is in a bowl, in, oh my God, but with rice instead of pasta. That is so good. Calamari. Calamari Yeah, nice. That's the best. Is the sauce good? Yeah, it's just like garlic in there. Oh, tough. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Yum. Yeah, that looks so good. So we got the pesto pasta. We got another Aperol as well. And then we got just the margarita. Yeah. Bambini. Bambina. The popular one. And it looks so yummy. So excited. Oh my god. Wow. Delish. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, this looks amazing. Okay, this is the pesto. I'm gonna taste test. Look, it's balancing on my apple roll. Do you don't want that? No, no, no. Give me a little bit. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the pesto. Mm. That's really good. I expected it to be really good. Just finished at Bambini. We just came out. We're gonna take the photos outside of the Eiffel Tower. It was. Amazing. Molly, what do you rate everything? 12 out of 10. 12 out of 10. Yeah. I feel like we said oh, that about everything. I feel really bad. I feel like we need a dub mail just to put everything into context at the moment. It's yeah. Just... Everything was so good. The pizza, the pasta, the aperols. Highly recommend. One of like my top three restaurants. It was oh, so good. A good atmosphere. Yeah. The atmosphere, the waitress was amazing. She's divine. She was just the biggest angel. She was perfect. Answered all our questions because neither of us speak Italian. So yeah, exactly. <laughs> it was perfect. And I'm pretty sure the Eiffel Tower is like <gasps> literally right there. That is gorgeous. Afternoon snack is going to be ice cream. They do crepes as well, which look really good. Nutella crepes to be more specific. Which are over there, but... What about a biscoff one? Huh? What about a biscoff one? Oh, biscoff, yum. Yeah, not in an ice cream. Thank you. Yum. This looks so good. Okay, so I got... A biscoff and... Stretch. Oh wow, I'm literally butchering everything. Can you film me? Well, you can say, it, yeah. How's your coke? Oh, it's hitting. Fuck! Out of 10 for refreshing. Oh, refreshing perfect. Out of 10. God, it's so dry. <laughs> so, compared to last night, last night was like creamier. Yeah. This is a bit more like icy. It's a cafe called La Maison Rose. It's really popular, I think, just because of its aesthetics. But it is on a really pretty street. Um, we're not eating here, but we walked past. And then they've got like outdoor seating here as well. But it is really pretty. And yeah, I think it's just popular because it looks nice. I don't know what sort of food they do, but I mean, it looks cute. Nutella donut. It's a long donut. And to this, what do you? How do you say it? Bull, bull and gurry. It sounds so bad. And uh, I just got a croissant. And then she gave us a little gift. Some chocolate. Oh, they look like chocolate covered something. I reckon the trophy eggs. Yeah, and that looks so good. And then we also just went to the store and got some groceries for our little picnic. Good. But we'll show you that when we get there. Let's go. 
we're just having our little picnic at the Eiffel Tower and we just went to a supermarket we got these little rosés which come with cups which is so handy we got a croissant we got some hummus and I showed you this before those lady gave us those these strawberries which are so huge Molly got some salami and then we got a mini baguette and then we got this cheese which was like cut up into little pieces which is cute oh and then some crackers as well so cute cheers cheers is innovative the french are just years ahead of us they really in are 24 oh yeah you make like a little sandwich oh my god i so can popular cheese and it's a big piece that's actually probably how i would usually cut it like that's how I big we just go the whole yeah just chuck it in. in there we go it's a sandwich and then maybe just like wrap it in salami yeah unbelievable <laughs> there we go two pieces shove that in <laughs> I'll taste this, this croissant. This is my third croissant. Mmm, good. I was thinking about to the <laughs> others. Um, the one this morning was really good, but this one's nice and like moist. You know how they can be dry inside? Yeah, super fresh though. It was a proper, proper bit of laundry. Yeah. Whereas this one's like an afternoon croissant. Yeah, um, have a bit of strawberry. But it's still really good. Yeah. Oh yeah. God wins. First yeah. ever. Strawberry. You go for the bigger one. In France. They probably picked it out of the field this morning. Oh my God, it's literally got sand on it. <laughs> That's how fresh they are. Oh, it's good for my immune system, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't kill you, makes you stronger. Ew. Okay. You did walk barefoot throughout Paris today. <laughs> I don't think a strawberry's gonna kill you. <laughs> wow. That, that is really good. It's probably sand from the south of France, anyways. Yeah, perfect. No, I love it. Yum. I got one of these. I got one of these sushi things from the supermarket. It's where you like, it's so it's in a triangle and you pull it and then it turns into like a roll or something. I don't know, I've seen them on TikTok. Okay, so I guess I just pull one. Yeah. Oh, okay. All the way, I yeah, guess. I okay, number one. Let's put that. Oh, and then I guess. It just like takes it off. Do I just keep that there? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> and then I pull number three. <laughs> I thought something groundbreaking was meant to happen. That's just showed you how to take the wrapper off. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you think aubergine is quite like a wet? Not, not a fan. Mm. The sushi, the sushi rice is really oily. Charming. Do you want to put it in the uh, the mixture? Not a tear out, Yeah. Put it in. <laughs> it's day two. We're at Le Cafe Mali. We just went to the the Louvre. The Louvre, which is right over there, and it's so pretty. We're just gonna have a small breakfast because we've got brunch in a couple hours. Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you. This is the menu for. The Cafe Mali. There's our view. There's the Eiffel Tower over there. And then there's the Louvre. The Louvre. Hello. <laughs> it's really pretty. Alright, so we got pastries. Panda chocolate. And then we just got some hot chockies with cream. And then I got a baguette. So good. Yummy. Right. Okay. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. Mmm. Like the cream is really good. Chantilly. It's like refreshing. Pretty sweet. French know their way around. Cream, cheese, butter. Oh my gosh, that's really good. Yesterday's was a little bit thicker. Yeah, this is more like English hot chocolate rather than the French. And we got our. Uh, Croissants, which are good. This one's a little bit more flaky. Oh my god, a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's very flaky compared to the other one. But it's still really good. I got my baguette. <laughs> my wee wee baguette. <laughs> what do you write down? It's a lot more flaky. Not as moist as the other ones. Mm, yeah, we like them moist. But it's still tasty. We like a moist croissant, but it's still tasty. Mm -hmm. Tasty chatty approved. Mm -hmm. It's a good cafe. Yeah. It's cute and good view as well. This is the outdoor part of Cafe Mali. All the seats is like there. That's where we just sat. 
they've got little outdoor seats, which is so cute. And then this is how busy it is outside. So nice. Okay, look at these croissants. They're strawberry croissants. And then they've got a cookie shot, praline. And then they've got croissant, croissant muffins. <gasps> that looks amazing. Oh my gosh, everything looks so good. And all the bread. Oh, I love tiger bread. Yeah. Okay, this is where we're going for an early lunch today. It's called Maison Savoir. That's probably not how you say it, but it's really cute. We came, I'm pretty sure we, yeah, we came on this street. Oh. That's where we had brunch the first day. And it's really cute. Okay, this is our table. We're right on the street. So cute. Oh, and there's my favorite ice cream place. It's a sign. It's a I should get them. So cute. It's so pretty. This is the menu. You just scan a QR code. And then they've got breakfast. We're here at 12 o'clock. So we are the lunch menu, which is this one. So we're gonna get the tahini Caesar salad and then chicken and salmon. And then we're gonna get a side of fries. So yummy. Merci. That looks so good. Okay, these are truffle fries. Truffle is the, the meal of the trip. <laughs> yeah, wow. And then we got a Caesar salad with chicken and salmon, which looks amazing. Yay! Look at that chicken. Thanks. Wow. That looks like chicken schnitzel. Yeah. And salmon. Oh, fried. Have it. What more could you want? So, we've just been doing some shopping and sightseeing. And now we're off to afternoon tea to a cafe called Corette. Which is one of the, what would you say, fancy Instagram, TikTok ones. It's a um, small chain. It's a small chain. Okay, it's a small chain. Highly rated. Highly. One of the top bakeries. One of the top bakeries. So we'll probably just get like a drink because honestly, we had those croissants and then we had the salad and truffle fries. And now we're go for afternoon tea, but we have to make most of it because we're only here for three days. Um, the lunch place was really good. Truffle fries, salad was good. What do you rate it? Salad was great. I was so full, I couldn't even finish my salad, which is so yeah. unlike me. But we shared. Molly was really full. Good idea sharing the chicken and the salmon, so both nice. Yeah, and we did book. We did book. We booked. He didn't even look at whether we booked, so. This time of year, probably fine. Yeah. Not booking, uh, <laughs> it's a quick turnover, but during peak season, yeah. it's an online booking, it's so easy. Might and there well. was still like a few seats when we were there. Yeah. But that was like Thursday at lunchtime. And definitely sit outside. They have sit a outside, bit yeah. upstairs. But, um, outside, but it was like good people watching. <sighs> good people watching. Yeah. It was like right on the street. We were like literally right next to the road, <laughs> which was cool. Um, and yeah, so now we're in this cafe, and then we've got dinner at 8.30. Yeah, this is the cafe crate. It's so pretty. Look at the roof. We're gonna try to get a table now. We've got a table, which is really lucky because honestly, it's quite busy. It's so pretty. And then there's like a park across the road. It's what time is it now? 4:30. Quarter to five. Wow, quarter to five. So yeah, little afternoon tea. Just got a little afternoon treat. We got a raspberry. I've honestly got no idea what it is. Uh, oh, it looks like pistachio. It's got a pistachio. Got pistachio. Okay. okay, do you want to cut it open? Oh my god, pressure. It's gonna like, okay. it looks like macaron almost. Yeah, just yeah. shove it in half. It's gonna crumble. Progress. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like hard. Okay. Nice. Nice. This bad that looks really good. There we go. Oh, yum! It's got like some like sort of pistachio cream or something inside of it. That looks so good. Back at the 
ice cream place where we got either flower ice cream and I'm gonna get a crepe. Nutella and get vanilla ice cream. Yeah, then. and banana. Okay, I'm gonna, I couldn't decide between ice cream and a crepe, so I'm gonna get that. Because I haven't had a crepe yet here. And this place, the ice cream is so good. I'm very excited. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Just for my first ever French crepe wow. from the place where I got the ice cream flour. So I got some normal crepe with hazelnut chocolate, which is some Nutella. And then I just got vanilla bean ice cream. Mm -hmm. So this is like a uh, dessert after afternoon tea. <laughs> just shove it in, just <laughs> that's the thumbnail right there. <laughs> Yum. Nice. How's the vanilla ice cream? The vanilla bean. So Scott, you can see the, the vanilla bean. Madagascan vanilla. Yeah, it's a good vanilla bean. Yeah. Amazing. Generous amount of Nutella as well. You feeling French? I'm feeling very French. Now. <laughs>